Anderson Cooper 360, weeknights at 8 and 10 on CNN. The details of this case are, are tawdry, to put it mildly. This all began at one of those infamous bunga bunga parties uh, that Berlusconi used to throw, right? Uh, that's correct. And uh, Mr. Berlusconi always insisted that these were uh, elegant parties in good taste. But certainly the details that have, uh, have come out, come out uh, during this trial point to something quite the opposite. Uh, they point to basically call girls being uh, hired to perform at these after dinner parties uh, in the so-called bunga bunga room, uh, where some of them, for instance, dressed up as Obama and engaged in sort of semi-erotic fondling of one another for the pleasure of the guests. So certainly the, the details point to a far less elegant and uh, good taste event than Mr. Berlusconi has insisted all along. D wow, that's quite a visual there. D does this ruling, I mean, d what does it really mean? Does it e effectively end his political career? Well, Mr. Berlusconi, really, for the last 20 years since he entered political life, has been battling one legal case after the other. This certainly, in terms of the details, uh, is beyond compare. But he's faced uh, charges of tax fraud, tax evasion, uh, abuse of power while in office. And certainly, he, he seems to get through it all with the help of a very well-paid and capable uh, legal team, but this time around, things may be coming to a head. It's not just this case. Uh, there's a case of tax evasion where he's already been convicted. Uh, he's gone through one appeal, and in the Italian system, uh, every initial verdict is followed by two appeals. But in this case, in this tax evasion case, uh, his final appeal comes up later this year, and it's widely believed it will be upheld by the courts, and he could, in fact, end up spending time uh, behind bars. But certainly, he is the ultimate survivor in the Italian political arena. And uh, today, he came out reacting to the verdict. He said, non mi rendo. Means, it means in Italian, I will not give up. And people take that sort of vow very seriously. Is he still, I mean, popular in some quarters? Because, I mean, over the years, despite all this stuff, he's remained a popular figure in Italy. He's a very charismatic, charismatic person. If you go to his speeches, you see a lot of people nodding in agreement uh, with what he says. What's interesting is that there's no Italians who, uh, Italians who have a neutral opinion of Silvio Berlusconi. But many Italians still come out and vote for him in election after election.